The Gulf of Aden on the edge of the Red Sea is the only way in or out for ships entering and leaving the Suez Canal, making it one of the world's busiest and most important waterways. On any single day, millions of tons of goods travel through this narrow strait that connects east and west. It's a crucial supply line for world trade, and with over 3 million gallons of crude oil passing through here each day, interrupting this vital artery could send seismic tremors through world markets. The uh, piracy has uh, increased throughout the Gulf of Aden, and uh, the Gulf of Aden is one of our major hubs for, uh, for uh, transnational shipping going through uh, en route to the Suez uh, Canal. So the uh, piracy uh, has a distinct impact on uh, the, the economies of the world, and we're, we're deployed here to, uh, to contribute to the international, uh, the international effort to reduce the amount of piracy and to maintain the security of shipping throughout the region. The critical waterway between the coast of Yemen and Somalia has become a hub of pirate activity, which now poses one of the biggest threats to merchant shipping on the planet. Controlling it and stemming the problem of banditry at sea has become a top priority for navies from all around the world. Task forces from the European Union, the United States, China, Japan and Russia are making their mark and have been joined by others from as far off as Malaysia and Korea. Now NATO has decided to send a fleet of its own. After leaving port in Lisbon, crossing the Mediterranean and passing through the Suez Canal, the NRP Corte Real is making its final port call in Djibouti before it sets sail for its tour in the Gulf of Aden. NATO's Standing Maritime Group 1's mission, Operation Allied Protector, is to deter and, if necessary, to fight pirates off the coast of Somalia that threaten the shipping lanes for a tenth of the world's trade. This mission is a contribution of NATO to security of the sea lines of communications on, uh, in the waters of Orno d'Africa in conjunction with uh, other nations and uh, other forces that are in, in this area. The five ships, including one each from the United States, Canada, Portugal, Spain and the Netherlands will conduct surveillance tasks and provide protection to deter and suppress piracy and armed robbery. Our tasks are mainly to uh, deter, to protect, to disrupt uh, pirate attacks uh, against shipping uh, here in the, the area operations, uh, which is the uh, Gulf of Aden, between Yemen and Somali coast. Under the cloak of night, the NATO flagship pulls out of Djibouti harbor and heads out to sea. Their course, the most dangerous waters in the world. This is Dan Morgan for the NATO Channel in the Gulf of Aden.